Ron from uh, Ron's Drone Tech and Camera Channel. And today we kind of combined all three things. Uh, we got the Altel Evo 2 Pro out here at the beach at uh, beautiful Margate City, New Jersey. Kind of a mix of sun and clouds here. But what, what we're going to demonstrate here is today the Evo 2 got a, a firmware update and the, uh, the app for the iOS got an update both yesterday. And they added several new features, and one of them is precision landing. Eh, I'm calling it what DJI calls it, but it's 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 like precision landing. It's gonna land right in the pad. Before it wouldn't, you know, it would come back land like a few feet where it took off, but it wouldn't do the precision landing. But let's see if it can do the precision landing. I got the pad set up right here on the beach here. Uh, we're gonna go out, you know, like a, a couple couple hundred feet, five hundred thousand feet. Then we're gonna come back and see if it lands right on the pad. So stay tuned. All right, folks, here we go. Let's do a uh, auto uh, takeoff here. I'll show you the button here. Revs the engines up. There we go, auto takeoff. Let's start recording for an HDR 4K30. So uh, it should be getting us on the video. Hello, uh, Evo 2. Let's do a uh, Marcus Crawford style up and out of here. All right, we're uh, out to about um, 500 feet. Should be doing a screen recording here. Let me uh, let me uh, do a screen recording for the second half of this uh, video here. Let me uh, pull this up here, and uh, I guess our exposure looks right here. Um, you know, it's a kind of a crappy evening here, but uh, I'm going to start a screen recording here uh, see if I can pull that down uh, screen recording so uh, now we're screen recording I think uh, you never know about these screen recording so let's go out to uh, about a thousand uh, thousand feet so we're still backing out here we're at uh, 800 900 Okay, there we're, we're really getting out there now look you can see the good view of uh, the ocean and everything here and we got a live feature too it always says I'm going live now so I uh, wonder if I'm really am going live or not who knows only the shadow knows all right so we're about 1500 feet and I think I have this in uh, like ludicrous mode or something like that so what's uh well we're back in standard mode okay yeah we didn't want to be in ludicrous mode okay so now we're we're you know we're out to uh, you know, out there, I hope you can see this on the camera here. Um, so I'm going to hit the uh, return to home button now. The aircraft is coming Go home. Go home. So, folks, she's uh, she's going up to whatever I had pre-set as the height. Uh, I don't know what it was here. It's uh, 200, 225. So now it's 225 uh, feet up in the air, and it's coming back. Um, again, we're going to see if it had, does the precision style landing that DJI does. I'm going to, at the end of the video, I'll tell you what, what the actual, um, what they actually call their precision, uh, landing thing, but it's, it's, uh, DJI's precision landing. This is precision something else or, or, or accurate landing. So, uh, but the point is, can it land on the pad? I, I, I've tried it, you know, before this update, I never saw it land in the pad. It would get, you know, within a few feet, uh, you know, which is good enough, but I can't, I couldn't do the parlor trick of actually landing on the pad. So, um, and I did calibrate the compass, uh, before this flight. Okay. Here it comes back here. It's already, it's already back. It, uh, moves along pretty good. So she's back. And uh, she looks like she's over the pad, and I'm going to see if it adjusts at the last minute, like the DJI, uh, you know, ones do. So she's the slowly coming down here. Success. The aircraft is landing. So that's kind of a new warning I've never seen before. So as you can see, she's coming down uh, 6.7 miles. It's looking good, looking good. 
And I guess I'll cancel if I think she's going to hit in the sand. Or push her back up again. Okay, see if she makes any slight adjustments here. Oh, she did. She made an adjustment. She saw the pad and moved over to it. Look at that. She was off, but she made the adjustment. Found the pad. Oh, boy. Folks. Look Stop at this. Stop recording. Look at this, folks. Look at that. Right in the circle of the pad. One of the most accurate landings I've ever seen from any of my drones. Wow. That is impressive, folks. So, let's, uh, let's do a recap here, folks. Okay, to, to recap everything, um, of course, she shut the, you know, I was taking video. She shut the video off when she landed, too, so that's really cool. So, uh, to recap, just as of, um, I think the update occurred on, uh, let's check the date today. Today is the 24th. I think somewhere on Friday, the 23rd of October, uh, maybe it happened overnight Thursday into Friday, uh, an app update appeared, an iOS app update appeared, uh, version 1.7.5, uh, and then uh, the firmware version for the aircraft, 2.5.1.1, which has been about in beta. You've seen a lot of people talk about the beta, um, you know, uh, up here. And uh, one of the said the features was, uh, uh, you know, a more accurate landing. I don't, I, I don't want to say precision landing. A more accurate landing because it wouldn't land right in the middle of the pad, which is kind of a parlor trick that the DJI drones have done for a while now. But um, and this did not happen until uh, just yesterday. But now, um, it uh, as you can see. Uh, it the uh, first time uh, again. I did calibrate the uh, compass because they have a new cal uh, compass calibration system. Where before you would you know you would do it uh, kind of uh, vertically and then you would do it horizontally. But now it's a third uh, compass calibration where you also uh, you know turn it uh, like sideways too. So I'll demonstrate that uh, in, in a in a video back at the back at the office. But uh, yeah. So uh, this was a, a big success. I don't want to uh, drone on here, uh, no pun intended, but I, I think you can see the demo and how it worked. And, uh, you know, just, uh, you know, subscribe to the channel, uh, you know, uh, click the video for more upcoming content on the Altel Evo Pro. And if you like this video and got something out of it, leave the old thumbs up and we will see you on the next one.